Hello everybody, welcome to week four of Super League. We've got a great match up here live. Strider with his Wood Elves versus Kfog with his Imperial Nobility, Dimmy's favourite. And in the booth is the Nut Man and the Knob Man. How <laughs> well you're doing, Dimmy? I'd just like to clarify that while the match is live, I am not. <laughs> Brilliant. <laughs> Love the energy, Elliot. <laughs> Woo! <-hoo! coughs> First take as well, Ellie. First take. <laughs> yeah, first take. Look oh, to see it. It's the three dice. Alina. This is this is where Fend really shines when there's a tree on the board. <laughs> Can't take sixty turns of this. <laughs> oh man! You should, be, you should make a poll. How many times will will Dimmy say how good Fend is? <laughs> the over under. It's the most underrated skill in Club Bowl. I don't think it is. I think Guard is the most underrated skill in Blood Bowl. Ah, uh, no. Guard's overrated. Well, I think it's underrated. I think everybody rates it in the top three, but I still think it's the most underrated skill. <laughs> it's really, 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 really good. As a free skill, Fend is alright. But you'd rather have Guard, wouldn't you? <laughs> if it costs what? nothing, it's all right. <laughs> <laughs> the most underrated skill in the game. <laughs> because nothing, it's all right. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I Nerves I of Steel wait. is all right if it costs nothing. I can't wait for Fen to win this game. It would be funny if it does, won't it? Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, the over-under on K-Fog misclicks. And then the over-under on Dimmy's love of, love of Fen. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Captain Oates. This is this is a Rick Reckless build from Home Nations. I think Kfo took Rick's build from. I, I'm not sure if it's exact. I think it's. Oh my God, the Ooh. ogre's kick. Is is he misclicked already? <laughs> I think he has. Yeah. He's, he's misclicked already. Like, honestly, I am <laughs> sick. I am sick of these top players <laughs> throwing games to make knobs look awful. Uh, it only <laughs> went five. <laughs> <laughs> this is a conspiracy, honestly. This is immense. <laughs> yes, I, I don't like this roster at all, honestly. Um, yeah, only two guard. Block Ogre's fine, right? Bludger's fine. But yeah, Mighty Blow Tackle, one of them skillless. Leader's fine. But yeah, I, I just don't like that um, lack of guard. Big lack of guard. I find problematic. You'll yeah, be free well next turn. Yeah. Fend OP, it was OP. <laughs> Why, Dimmy? Why was it OP? Well, because it'll be free next, not next turn, the turn after, <laughs> wouldn't <laughs> Not necessarily. Just having a break. And also something of note is he's keeping all these elves on the line and not daquering. I mean, he could have just dackered. They're doing that by being armor seven. Yeah, they're doing, they're doing that by being armor seven and, yeah. and just begging you to punch them in the fucking face. Yeah, exactly. If they had armor eight instead of fend, he would dacker. Therefore, fend makes him not dacker. Mm, okay. Yeah, yeah. This is it. He's, but he's then fend isn't free then, so they're, they're, they're because, it ceases to be a good skill if it's not for free. <laughs> Well, there, there's still 11 knobs on the pitch, so this is this is already like really heavily favoured towards Kfo. Mm. So. And the, the irony of having a tackle mighty blow blitzer with wrestle is you're not scared about blitz in wrestle. <laughs> yes. Because <laughs> it doesn't matter. So, the wrestle doesn't exist for Strider. He's basically got two pointless skills. It's, uh... We're, uh, we're doing some extreme coping here. <laughs> <laughs> Opium through the roof. Oh yeah, do you know what? You need to, you, you you need your knob team needs to be like DG Copium. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, amazing. 
Why Daka versus Nob? Why, why not Daka, isn't it? Like, they're probably going to beat you up. They've, they're the fighty team. They're hitting mm. you with a block 90 blow every turn. They've got some rest, uh, guards. I think it's, is he going to blitz with Ogre or is it space, I guess? 3D with the Ogre, innit? 3D? 3D. Mm. Don't want to blitz with a shitty wrestler, do you? Yeah, but the wrestler doesn't need to roll a 2 plus the blitz. Yeah, but smash with Mighty Blow, innit? Only come for a 2D then. Mm. Doesn't get him. Does not get him, Jim. And he's made a nice little gap for the tree to step into. That's a risky gap, though, isn't it? That is a risky gap. He could just blitz the ogre with the tree. <laughs> Don't think he will, though. He's quite, quite conservative, his old strider. Oh my god, all these time. I somehow, somehow he thought that, that Kefal was playing the, the Wood Elves and the Knobs. I don't know. I, I, knew, I knew he was Knobs, but I also thought he was playing Wood Elves. <laughs> I mean, it wouldn't surprise me if anyone was people <laughs> playing games against themselves, it would be Kefal. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's true. I expected him to take uh, Woody's for this, but uh, yeah, he went for the knobs for fun. And he's like, it's not fun. <laughs> <laughs> he's obviously AFK. He's playing a game on Fumble as we speak. Yeah, probably. He probably is the Wood Elves on a Fumble game. <laughs> yeah. AOs, bodyguards. Pretty sad. Eating into his uh, his time bank here. Oh, he, he appled it instant. Yeah, yeah, I think that's fair. What was she gonna use it for? Instant apple. It's perfect. Turn two KO. I think this is like the right time to apple, right? And is the skillless one though, isn't it? Skillless bodyguard, is it? Yeah. It's a bodyguard, yeah. I'm surprised we didn't like put a feel around the other side. Maybe this guy will go. Maybe you won't though. Yeah, but Chris, it also stops you getting surfed by frenzy, so you can you can use Fen to like be the front side of the screen when they've got a frenzy player. It's amazing. It's 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 so good in so many situations. <laughs> Sorry. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why I'm laughing. No, it's all right sometimes, but yeah, it's all right for free. Like it's all right on good players as well. Like you know, like if uh, if you've got like quite a good player in progression, and then you've got another skill, just whack fend on it. Like oh, it does tackle, things sometimes. Tackle. But it's, uh, like it's very marginal. It's very glorious. It really is. Uh, no, I won't give in. But you know, you get more use out of it than running past. Me. And I will defend. I will defend. Yes. Four. I don't take any. I don't take any of that running past on my teams. Yeah. Nope. Not. Not for me. No, I'm sorry. Thank you very much, D Starter. Getting your uh, glorious beaver pregnancy there. Thank you very, very much. Whoa. Yeah, Elf made Fend okay, not be around exactly. Yeah, you want Blood Step. And then with Fen, you know, I can do something. There was another for Beaver Town there on, on the stream. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> Three dice. Triple pals. Tree dice, Dimmy. Tree dice. I just said tree dice. I thought you said three dice. I said tree dice. Come on. Oh, okay. Sorry. Tree dice. Why you blow, Why you blow gets it? Mm. No, no, it doesn't. He would have carried him anyway. Ignore me. Fendor. Fendor P. Yeah. Oh, he stopped the tree getting on the ogre, so not bad. I don't think he'd want to, right? Because he just knock him down with block. <laughs> like he'd, uh, he'd have to back him up if he... 
If he calls me the ogre, he's got to make sure he can't get too deep. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah. Oh, I should put the uh, rings on so you can see the catches are three catches. Yeah, I was yeah, thinking. Yeah. I was thinking if there's ever a turn to go ham and base everything, probably this next one. Mm. This is the problem with not having the four guarders. Yeah. Yeah, it's a lot harder to uh, do Just anything. Dominate. <laughs> yeah. If they pile in, they're likely to just get beaten off. Oh, the chain for the ogre. Lovely. Oh, no, for the, oh, the other guy. The other, I didn't see that guy, sorry. I was just I just wanted the ogre hit. Well, he gets the ogre hit if he doesn't get him on this one, yeah, which he yeah. does. Yeah. Hey, he gets Way. him. Is it the mighty blow? No. Uh, yeah. Mighty Blow got the armor break, yeah. yeah. Nice. Yeah, it would have been nothing without Mighty Blow. Nice. I think that's the first time in four games. Yeah. Yeah. Well, well worth it. <laughs> the big payoff. Huge. One Kaz yeah. every four games. I mean, it's the best skill in the game, right? Mighty <laughs> Blow. <laughs> Better than Fend. <laughs> no, it's not. It's not. Obviously, like, imagine if Fend imagine is... if the lineman had mighty blow instead of Fen. <laughs> It'd be actually kind of mint. Let's not go crazy, crazy Jim. Jim. <laughs> freaking just make an old peasant team and just fucking bang people out. <laughs> be class. Oh wow, tree blitz on the ogre. Mmm. Uga, the mountain. Yep. Look at that. That Kitran, the dog of Malefex. If only it was the dog of Quatrex. <laughs> that would have been perfect, wouldn't it? But it's, tragically, no one else knows about the Quatrex. If the Ogre had Fend, very good point. That would have stopped the tree in its tracks. <clears throat> Maybe if the imagine if the the ogres had Fen, but the, the Lyman had Mighty Blow, that would be the best, the best of all possible worlds. Oh, he's left the jump over the ogre. He has, and now the ogre blitz. The ogre blitz base. Hang on, is there a way to chain? Oh, he's powered him. Hmm. I mean, the jump isn't as good as just dodging into the cage, to be fair. Yeah. <laughs> I well, mean, that's, that's, your, your, that's your thing, isn't it? Like, just doing random dodges, uh, random jumps. You've got to jump. You've got to look for the jumps. Everyone should aspire to be as good as Keat. Keat. Boing. Keat was really great at spotting the jumps. You wait. You wait till you you level up and realise pogo is a thing. Oh, I don't want pogos. Oh my god, it's so good. <laughs> Can I get a tackle on the ball here? Mm. Yeah. Meh. Then he just mm. runs around and bases the other dancer. Oh, it doesn't follow. Hmm. Hmm. Mm. Gave that elf Fen for free there. Bloody ah. bases. Ah. Interesting. Oh, I love it when they four plus dodge. Oh my god, it's so good. <laughs> that was a three because it was a it was a throw. That was a throw. Yeah, but a liner would have made it, so it's, it's <laughs> fine. <laughs> you could have had Fen. You could have been another player with Fen. He would have made that dodge. <laughs> yeah. This is a little bit tricky, isn't it? Blodge, two-headed yeah. pogo. 
Oh, it's not tricky at the ball safe, are you? Okay. Thanks it's about that. as tricky as it gets for the Woodies. Thanks, <laughs> thanks for the hype build, Elliot. <laughs> oh, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Look, I was just thinking how many knobs are we going to bang on this turn of light? <laughs> it's yeah, turn it five, like, time's creeping on. Yeah? No, oh, no. What are the Wood Elves going to do? <laughs> They've got to get forward! They've got to get forward! <laughs> <laughs> oh, block Ooh. is pretty good on an Ogre. I do like a yeah, block kind of weird that we've ended up taking so many hits on this Ogre. Seems a bit weird. Yeah, I didn't really like... Caging right next to him in the first. Oh, now, place. now he's basing his own player on the on a, on a knob yeah. as well. Oof. He's gonna have to dodge the ball, isn't he? And then, uh, and no, then do, we can do a two D, can't you? You can't, you can't do a two D here. You've got two strength two players. You can't entrust it to a. Um... Oh, you mean block block him with two D? Yeah, okay. Yeah, Sorry. but then there's a guard there. I'm like... confused. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what 2D we couldn't do. <laughs> the, the tree, the tree 2D, you can't do right. Oh, you, you've got to, you've got to get the oh, ball safe first before you do the tree right. 2D. Yes, yeah. yeah. Sorry, that's what I was mean. That's what I was talking about. So I was. <laughs> oh, where's the one in nine? Oh, Just I got the one in nine. Does get to follow, not no fend. So, if only the fucking ogre had fend, Jimmy. <laughs> Most underrated skill in blood ball, you know. You guys are just mean. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not made of wood, you know. <laughs> Larry Elliot era. Yeah, I, lo I do love the Larry Elliot era, to be honest. <laughs> so he could block away the dodger and then he gets to block the I think uh, no he's frothing at the mouth isn't he there's a dancer he can smash with tackle mighty blow he's just he's, he's already in it but yeah. he's gonna yeah it's kfo into a T he gets to hit the true mighty blow he gets to smash a dance with tackle mighty blow this is yeah. this is where he forgets to stand players up and does all that other stuff that he did yeah there we go he's in Bosh. he's in no, oh. you, you'll do reroll instant. That's wild, that yeah. isn't it? Nah, nah. It's like he needs to do it. Like he's so far behind. It's two games. K Fogs blitzed with his mighty blow into a dancer, and both times instant reroll. Oh, ball base, GG. I think it's wild that there's there's uh, you know that it's made his mind is made up before he goes in. It's just definitely, he's always hitting, nah. rerolling the hits on the Man, dance. like, if it's a dance, I'm, like... I'm, I'm, my mind is made up there. Yeah? Yeah. I, I, d I, well, I don't know, I didn't see the other reroll, but that one, and, yeah, I, I was going to smash that. <laughs> Here comes the ogre. Yep. Come on. No, he's going to tag there. Come on, Mr. Oh, my God, he's you blabbered. Do Garbage. Nothing. He's got... Garbage I mean, to be fair, the ogre survived like three blocks, right? He took three pushes, like. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah, let him go. Interesting. Yeah, so he can clear the guards. So it's, uh... mm. I'd like, like, he gets a mighty blow hit on a bodyguard with like no yeah. apo in play, right? It's worth it, I think. I mean, you might have got a mighty blow hit on a bodyguard anyway. This is a bit weak. Oh yeah, it? I guess. Yeah, uh, yeah, but. Yeah. A bit what? I oh, see. It also weak. weak it, it weakens the left side, right? Yeah. So you can just blitz that Lino now, and he's through. Yeah, I'm surprised everyone. he followed. I'm surprised he followed. I wouldn't have followed there. There's, there's big Kev. I think he just yeah. wants to. <clears throat> oh, well. Not. Oh, no, stand firm. <laughs> stand oh, firm's oh, oh. a lot better than a fen, to be fair. It's it's up there. <laughs> it's way better than fen. It's not in the same stratosphere. Stratosphere. I mean, the thing is, if you use stand firm, you just get banked on more. Whereas if you fen, you you know, sometimes like once every like seven million games, get banged on less. Yeah. So you know, maybe fen is better. Maybe. 
See, this is why I didn't like doing this, because now he's committed two players, and uh, these two players could have come with him, couldn't they? I would have definitely yeah, just gone straight for this. I was not watching, but why is that side step dancer there? I don't, I don't know what happened. Yeah, he wanted, he he wanted blocked, to punch this guy. He blocked bodyguards. Yeah. He, he oh, he to, blocked yeah, bodyguards. So he, he put him in to punch he, as well. He didn't want to have to dodge uh, off tackle. But, you know, yeah. you're only 75% to knock him down anyway, aren't you? Yeah. And then, so I would have really rather just late. have the two players. Yeah, just get the next players on the pitch. Yeah. Mm, three re-rolls, I think. Mm. <clears throat> I don't know. Fenn did cost him a square of movement, yeah. I'm quite surprised they didn't try and put him in for like range though, because... Yeah, one more square would have been in range, wouldn't he? Yeah. Oh, Lona. Wowee. Here we go, boys. It's, it's on. This is it. This is where the knobs spring into action, and it's <laughs> game over. He gets to smash the dancer again, and then he cuts him off. Will he even smash the dancer? Yeah, hundred percent. I think he'll want to get he. back. I think he'll want to get back. You know, near the ball. Yeah. No, he Kill smashes the dancer, the dancer instant. Yeah. Worth it. And he's the side stepper as well, so he's the one turn on it. <clears throat> Not the one turn into the thing with all the bodyguards, but true. True, he needs to get he needs to remove two bodyguards, doesn't he, before he can one turn? <laughs> yeah. Another reason to uh, receive, I guess, for for Strider. Ooh. That's not bad, it's got block. You know. He's going ooh. <laughs> Man, he's, it's, these elves' armor is not breaking, man. It's not. It's, uh, but this is pretty strong, isn't it? These two in here. People yeah. tell me knobs are no P. They're not. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Wrong, Jimmy. He boneheaded. Wrong, <laughs> Oh, no. That's so disappointing. <laughs> <laughs> it makes the leap out harder here. Yeah. So it's no tackle. What is that? That's four, three. Well, this is tricky. It is pretty well played. I mean, it's not that tricky. <laughs> But if I keep saying it, it you know. It is, no, it is. <laughs> this is more tricky than the last one that you said was tricky. Just blitz this guy and then run away. Yeah, but. One, two, three, blitz, four, blitz, five. Blitz six, who? Six, what, with the dancer? So you're going to do the three plus dodge? This guy goes there, and then he two pluses out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Or seven there. What, and next then, to the ogre? Yeah. And then he goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Got to roll some dice though. Twos. 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 This guy twos out. This guy comes back. This guy runs around. Oh no, this guy's assistant. This guy runs around. This is where he gets a push and fend is like amazing. Oh yes. This is it. This is his big moment. Like Martin McCutcheon. Okay, yeah, that one's assisting, okay. That was a song, wasn't it? This is uh, my perfect moment. <laughs> There you go, Fend. Absolute disaster for the Wood Elf who wanted to go in the other direction. <coughs> I mean, if you got the pushes there, he has to re roll it, right? Nah, it's just having a two, isn't it? Yeah, maybe. The problem now is he's blocked his own path. So now he's probably got a GFI. No, he's not. Oh, no, it hasn't because he can go there, but yeah. Okay, one. 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's kind of blocked his own path a little bit. Not massively, but a little bit. But now Whoa. he's geofying with a ball, yeah. Oh my uh -huh. god, he double wand it. So he, he did Bob's he did block pay. his path. Oh. <laughs> Turns out he did block his path with that one. <laughs> wow. And, he and he hasn't us. stood anyone up, so like there's 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 like a handoff here. Just get the hell out of there. He can even score himself. Oh my <coughs> god. Big Kev. <coughs> I'm so excited I actually sat up. Oh my god. Extreme levels of fucking I erected. Right I erected. <laughs> I erected. <laughs> he can land after this one, can't he? That's what he wants because he's got catch. So he can go one, two, three, four, five, six. And he gets further away from the dancer. I'm the non tackle dancer. And then fuck off down here. Whoa, this is actually pretty strong for Big Kev. He's declared the handoff successfully. And he's made the handoff. Wow. Oh, see? OP. So good, he didn't even need to use catch. <laughs> yep, yeah, huge, these two are uh, not standing, isn't it? Let's him get all this down as well. Unbelievable. Unbelievable stuff from Big Kev. Where's, where's all the people now? Where's all the doubters? <laughs> Where's all the doubters? Where are ya? Who are ya? <laughs> chat's, chat's gone quiet, it's all gone silent. <laughs> Holy fuck, he's actually got the ball as well, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, shit. Welcome That's back to the game, Elliot. <laughs> 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 there was a double one, uh, there was a double one for... Yeah, uh, I saw that part, uh, but... <laughs> well, it was, it was just one time. What did you He just knocked it away yeah. and then yeah. picked it up. <laughs> yeah, Elliot, Elliot waking up periodically is pretty funny. <laughs> you only take you know very you know occasional glances at the screen, okay? Yeah. To me, that just means this is a terrible joke. It's not really a joke. It's just what I thought. That like when he said Elliot waking up periodically, that like. You'd just wake up and be like, Sodium Chloride! <laughs> uh, I, now, I, now, I think that's hilarious. <laughs> you might not get, like, such enthusiasm you know, for the quarters. Isn't, isn't that so? <laughs> yep. Well, no. Is it? I don't know. No, sodium. I don't. I don't even know. I'm pretty sure that is, is exactly it? what salt is. Yeah. Is that knackle? Knackle, yeah. Oh dear. <laughs> Dimmy's sitting there, totally unimpressed. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, I did. Yeah, thank you. But yeah, no, I, I, I missed out on being shorter. So apparently, I'm um, reserved. So if someone drops out. Uh, yeah, sure mm. There we go. What a half here. Um, Nob's doing the business. Big Kev ends the half 1 0 up. One player up. And receiving the ball. Will this be the first win from <laughs> Pure and Ability? I mean, this is going totally as expected, so. Um... <laughs> It's really not. <laughs> <laughs> Before this game, knobs were no wins, one draw and six losses. <laughs> so um, this could be the first knob win, but there's still a long way to go, isn't there? There's, there is an active strip ball. There is no sure hands at all on the, uh, on the knob team. So this could definitely end up being a 1-1 match. It's not over. Don't say it's over. Alright, no crap.
crazy kickoff event? No. Nope. Pretty good. Yeah, a bit bit deep, but not terrible, is it? I mean, deep's actually all right. I think deep's better than shallow, to be honest with you, because it gives you time to set up properly. Hmm. Like when you one new up, like. I think I'd rather the ball there than like in between the bodyguard and the lino there. Interesting. I would, yeah. Mm. Nobs. It means if he doesn't make the pick up, he doesn't have to re roll it. Yeah, he's really going defensive here, isn't he? Okay, I, I like I like this. He's he's doing a fucking knob dacker, isn't he? <laughs> yeah, let's go. <laughs> Glorious knob dacker. It's the pal. Surprised he didn't take the both down, to be honest. Yeah, that was amateur. He should have one hundred percent took the both down. Yeah. Mm. Would have cast him. I mean, it would have also kept him based up as well, wouldn't it? Like, interesting. Interesting to take the power there. Not what I would have done. Who can say if it's good or bad? Like, that's interesting, because I would, I would have just definitely taken the ball down. I don't understand why he wouldn't. Yeah. Any ideas? To be fair, that, <clears throat> to be fair mm -hmm. that, happens, that happens to me sometimes, though. So. It's so rare that I see a pal that when I roll one, my <laughs> my instinct is to act to, to, to instantly click it. Yeah, maybe, maybe. I'm like, oh my god, I haven't seen one of these in seven turns. <laughs> like, I've just got to press it. Yeah, maybe it wasn't a hundred percent a uh, a this is the right move play from K Fog. Maybe he just yeah. So. It was on a pal drought and just like grabbed it with both hands. Yeah, that's fair enough. Wow, look at Fen there. Wow. <laughs> yep. He sure wanted to follow. I mean, power droughts are real, honestly. <laughs> Interesting. It's just a standoff. Last time there was a standoff, the Woodies ended it <laughs> really easily. <laughs> <laughs> It was just a leap in 1v power, wasn't it? Or something like that. Mm. That's what it usually is, isn't it? Flipping woodies. It's, it is rough, like. I mean, he's got two guards, so he can at least he can, like, cage corner the guards, can't he? Or he can, like, Venger bus. Oh. Oh, no. Imagine having a wrestle blitzer. Yeah, so we're going guard cage corners. Will we see a cage assault? I don't think so. But I mean, you still could, right? Like, uphill with strip is still pretty decent. But I think, I mean, Strider does play pretty conservatively. He's only one player down, I think. He'll be in no rush to go for the... Uh, oh, I would have gone for the thing. Ogre Dodge there. Wow. Ogre Dodge, tag the stripper. Mm. Raul mode. What a, what a thing. I think you're crazy uh, doing by the way for that. That's my analysis of that ogre dodge. It's only a 4 plus. True. Oh, he doesn't use it. Stand firm OP. Does he two assist foul the tackler? He could, couldn't he? I don't know. It's hard, like, when you got ten players. <clears throat> I mean, he's hardly, like, a removal machine, is he? No. Looks like he is, though. 
Yeah, the fact it's not really like costing him positionally to do it, that's the thing, isn't it? Like he's ending in a pretty nice mm -hmm. shape. Well, if he leaves him there, he's going to get smashed with Tack and Waiting again. I guess he might be trying to draw one of the guarders out. I think this turn could have been a lot worse for KFO. Like this was a lot more passive than I anticipated. Yeah, I think Strider tends to be ooh tends to be a bit passive and uh, conservative. Don't say the c word, Jim. <laughs> you can say conservative. It's not a dirty word. It's not. It's not just politics. Oh, is it? and the pal. He gets to hit him with a guarder. And then you just, blitz the catcher. You might just blitz him though. He really doesn't like dancers, does he? I hate dancers, to be fair. Hmm. But yeah, I think it's best just to hit him with a guarder. <clears throat> he's gonna he's gonna do it, he's doing it with a tackle guy. Yep. Gets it's him. the pow rewarded. Drum roll. <laughs> Golden Tooth, about to get knocked out. Oh, oh feel the, the O-penis. Feel the, the O-penis. Apple, instant. Yep. Yeah, 100% Apple, yeah. Yep. No need. No need to tink about that one. Looking really nice for uh, Kev. Yep, got the guard at the back and the. Uh, I mean, does this one doesn't need to be guard, does it? But it's got the Venga bus with the guard at the back, which you need. So I think again we'll just see another conservative turn from Strider. See, and this is where the stand firm comes into play because you can't like chain him or do anything exciting. It's just. Just hit him and yeah. Oh, didn't stand foul. He could. He, he could foul him here. Interested. The old penis, the classic, the classic Mully D. Really feeling the old penis. <laughs> Got to uh, treat him. Gonna... Well, it's only a one assist foul, right? I guess that's why he didn't. Two assist. Foul. Two assist. He could put somebody in as well. And then two assist foul. Then. Oh, right, from the floor. Yeah. It leaves him kind of narrow, though, right? It does. But I wouldn't hate it. I think being narrow is okay, right? Because as long as then you're not giving them the middle, if they then switch to one of the sides, then you can try and shut them down. And he kind of is na he's kind of naturally oh no yeah he's okay it would need a GFI if it didn't need a GFI then he was naturally going back to that square. Now it looks a bit worse fouling with two assists. Because now he'd have to give up the side, wouldn't he? Well, hey, rooted. Ooh. Pushes. Fend. Oh, Fend. Dear. Oh, he's rooted. He can't follow anyway. Exactly, but it's like he's got fend, isn't it? That's what I'm saying. Yeah, Oak has <laughs> fend. Oak has got fend. Look how yeah. IP that was. Yeah, he does the one assist foul. Wow. Injured. Oh my god, no oh, apple. Oh. Dirt bag. That's a send off though, right? No? Double sixes. Yeah. It is. Yeah. He'll take. At least you trade in. Yeah, at least you trade in. Like, I mean, I, I know what you're saying. Like, Stride will take the trade, but. But like, at least it is a trade. Yeah. Okay, five. Would have been much worse had he not got anything out of it. Yep. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Six and ten, sixty ten. I wonder. I wonder if he's gonna blitz the stripper with the ogre. <laughs> he might. Oh, maybe probably. Oh, yeah, he could stand up the thrower, couldn't he? Yeah, he might. 
I don't hate it. I mean... Like... I think he might be able to capture though, right? If he does the capture... 3D. Then he gets the tag for you. And he's, he's on three players. Oh my god! We'll never know. <laughs> he was blitzing! <laughs> Um, well, judging by what I've seen from K4, it's 100% the stripper. Yeah, maybe. I think they're both no, they... quite good, though, right? This is a 2D with, with Mighty Blow. And then if you go there, it's a 3D with Mighty Blow, and you get to sandwich him and stuff. So, And reconnect with the rest of the team. So they, they were both like... He, moved, he hadn't moved the Blitzer either, so you get the follow-up hit with the Blitzer as well, I think. Mm. So, yeah, it was, it was. they both had like... I mean, obviously, the, it's purely damage, but then... You know, the the stripper is like the most dangerous player on the team. So, yeah, it's interesting. Is he just going for the strip? Mm. I don't think so. I don't. I, th I think he's going to wait one more turn, right? Oh, well, maybe. He's kind of basing everyone. Like, so if you're going in, you kind of want to have someone to react to it, right? Yeah. Oh. The front of the cage was a line off. Oh god, the double skulls. Doesn't think about it too much. Yeah, wants, wants to get the start to him. Injured! Oh Ooh. man. Can't even hand off to the ogre because he's boneheaded now. Yeah. This is interesting, isn't it? Will Will Cable <clears throat> keep the dancer back, or will he push him around? You know what? Do you know what, Jim? What? I think I'll one D up the side here, one D the wrestler, and then run up the side. Yeah, he might, he might, he might try and cover that with a dancer, might he? No, he's coming around the back. Maybe this one will cover down the side. <laughs> We're running past now. It is getting pretty constricted, yeah, so he's just going for more. Yeah, it's looking better and better that one day now, yeah. The problem is, of course, the ball down isn't very good, but the push is fine. Mm. And you're not getting through very well, but... You know, at least you get like four players through, don't you? And you get the ogre across, so you get the mm -hmm. ogre up to there. And then this guy could one, two, three, four, five, six GFI, and then you get him through, and him through, and him through. Like he's got dodge, so you you do get quite a lot through going that way. Or he can just go straight through the middle. Yeah. It's still going to be like wide open though, right? Yeah. Hand off to the, oh, he can't hand off to the Ogre. Oh, he's, the powered the, he's powered the stripper. That's pretty good. That's massive. Yeah. That is really big. But now still... he could just potato. He could just potato now. And bludge with trust. I mean, it's not even that easy to potato, is it? Uh. Well. Like 1D Blitz off the bodyguard. Yeah. Gets the full pow. Oh no, it's he's dodge. He did roll a full yeah. pow, he just didn't that. Well, but then now he, now he can dodge the blitzer out as well, so he could he can do Oh <clears throat> I thought he was gonna go one square right and up and then I thought you were gonna move the ball and then you were gonna dodge the blitzer and go to the sideline to like get a screen. No, I think he wants to get the ogre involved. Probably should have moved the ogre first, right? Oh yeah, yeah. To see if the ogre was there and then he would know whether he was going to go down the sideline as you suggest. I would have, yeah, yeah, I would have screened him, but then... No yeah, so that, that... To move the ogre right and just see if it's partaking. That bodyguard I would have been up and right one square. Mm. And then move the, move the ball in. And then uh, dodge the blitzer and cover the left side. I mean, I wouldn't have done any of that. I would have just one deed out the outside and lost. <laughs> but having now seen what he's done, oh, he's full potato. He's off. Yeah. Do all the GFIs. Do them all. Oh. Yes. 
Nobs don't fail GFIs, Jim. They're OP. <laughs> really oh, should have moved the ogre first. Oh, he's failed that Oh, enough. no, Jim. And he hasn't moved the ogre. Was he going to GFI here? So the only thing that makes know. sense is that he was like going to GFI to here or something. Oh, the ogre's sad. Yeah, just move him there if you're not going to move him near the ball. It seems weird to not, not activate him at all. Because that actually can make a difference with these guys coming up and running down there and stuff. No, no, it doesn't actually. It makes no difference at all. But still, if he was anywhere else, he'd be a lot better, wouldn't he? <laughs> Or maybe so he was going to GFI to there and then have like a little mini screen there rather than the mini screen behind. Another, another 1 in 36 and it's uh, going to be bad times for Strider anyway. I actually don't like this, using two players to block a stand firm. Obviously makes sense because it gets your tackle uh, get my tackle your dancer through. If you power. Yeah. Okay, I'm just walking past. The ogre to taunt him, and then he double ones again, and uh, it's not totally on for Big Kev, but it's uh, it's decent, isn't it? He's got a couple more players to bring up. Oh wow, look at that! Big Kev with the emote, look. No, no, it's not. That was that was uh, Strider. That was Strider with uh, despair. <laughs> Nobs OP. Nobs OP. Take a bow. Oh my god, it cars. Take a bow. Three plus for the win, Jim. Nah. It's three two two for the win. I don't think he'll do the GFIs. Nah, you don't need to do the GFIs. What's he gonna do? I'll pill him with a catcher. Yeah. Don't be silly. You having a babble? Tim Bath, mate. Alright. Alright. <laughs> Big Kev OP. I mean, Strider's just snake twice, I mean, that's. He's made, he's made a lot of dodges, though, so, like, you know, some of them are going to be snakes, aren't they, at the end of the day? Lots of dodges and GFIs. It's not too crazy that he snaked twice. All right, here we go. Massive three plus it's for good. the W. Oh, yeah, you gotta reroll this. Oh, oh my care. God! Oh my God! Human agility, fucking him. <laughs> That's so frustrating. Yeah. And you can just like pick it up and score. Jump out on a four plus, pick it up on a three plus, hand it off on a three plus. One, two, three, four. But he can just dodge. I can't hand off, which is good. Well, this guy could jump. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Jump over four plus. Nah, it's, then you're just better off dodging, aren't you? Cause then you could that dance, that dance is not in range. I guess it's still there's another turn afterwards, but yeah. Fend! OP! Fend, fend, fend. Hey, I obviously just stepped out of the room to shout at a cat after he <laughs> failed to pick up. <laughs> I haven't seen Rumbad shout at his cat for a while. No, no, no. Yeah, he must have got rid of it or something like that. Yeah. It's the Blood Bowl 3, it's just, you know. Dulled his senses to the point where I just need a cat shot. 
Wow. Oh. Like one day, One's on that. Oof. The classic, the classic Dimmy cry. Oh, I wouldn't have done that. <laughs> Gets the ball. He's got to do the dodge because he's got a follow up hit. He's got a sidestep. Oh, of course he has. Disregard. But, but it gets him an extra hit anyway, doesn't it? So I think if he had the re roll, he would have GFI, but without the re roll, I think. See, I think I would have tagged the wrestle because I don't want him blitzing with wrestle. I would have I would have let him just blitz with block. Yeah, don't want to blitz him with wrestle or assist with guard, so yeah. Oh. The double ones. Yeah, the wrestles is better hit, best hit now, isn't it? So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or you can three Ooh. dice with wrestle as well. And then just hope that one of. Oh no, he's got sidestep. I was gonna say hope one of the, the blitzers catch it because there's no way he's picking it up. <laughs> <laughs> it's just no way. Oh, he's, oh yeah, you can cut off the squares he can sidestep to. Right, right, right. Oh no, he's not going to wrestle. Oh, he hasn't picked the wrong player again. No, he? no, this this one's a this one's a bodyguard. Oh, okay. Don't worry. Do you take the hit with the blitz of first, and then hit rip blitz with the wrestle? I guess you no. Know, yeah, it's only no, no. I guess you can't, because that's stopping you getting a three dice, right? So you you need to get the assist for the three D, and then this gives you the follow up anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, he doesn't get him. Reroll, gets him. Oh, thank god. <laughs> Fully invested Man, in I'm, the knob story. I'm living this game, Jim. I'm living this game. Like, oh my god. <laughs> I've never God. wanted love. To, I've never wanted love to win so much in my life. Oh, I caught it! Yes. <laughs> yeah. Spot on. Spot on. He could not catch it. He could not pick it up, but he could catch it. It's the only way, Jim. It's the only way. <laughs> yeah, get in. <laughs> oh, Kev, drop an emote, mate. Come on, please. You've got to drop an emote. Wow. Knob the life. The crowd go wild, knobs are gonna win. What a time to be alive. Everybody's favourite team. I mean, it was never in doubt, was it? It was never in doubt. There was a fair bit of doubt, didn't it? <laughs> Only from the doubters. <laughs> yep. Yeah. <laughs> Look at me now. <laughs> Well, that takes the pressure off me a bit for my last game because my last game was against Chuntra and I didn't really I really didn't want to be the only person who lost to the ability. Oh wow. <laughs> where's where's this put Strider? Strider was doing alright. Strider beat Monitor, right? Um I think I so. Sure. You can look it up or whatever. Was it a draw? Oh we well we would just watch it look at it after the game. Yeah, we can look at the table. But, I mean, the table thing. Yeah. I mean, this is certainly a big Kev win, isn't it? It's just that it's 2 0, 2 1. So, um, yeah, it's definitely like, unless there's a timeout, which will give him three turns, and then he one turns, and then it's still. I mean, it's. The, the, no, it's not. It's not. It's not, it's not a timeout, so it's it's probably cooked now. Yep. So, yeah, um, Strider was in second place on four points, and that loss has really put the cat amongst the pigeons, because that puts KFOG up to three. Monitor and Tree are on three and two. Um, Olivia is on three, and Monitor and Tree are playing right now, so it's all to play for. KFO's got Olivia last, doesn't he? Ooh. I believe, because he's played all three woodies. Yeah. Yeah, he must have. And then. Who else? Is that. Uh, no, is it all three of his games against the Woody? Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, he's got Olivia de Lac last year. Strider's Who got three it? and Diamond's got monitor. Oh, has KFO played Diamond yet? Yep. He lost. 2 0. 
I don't remember seeing that game. You made a misclick. <laughs> Shocking. Another me. one. Another <laughs> one. Yeah. That wasn't the the misclick with the pass. Like not passing, was it? I don't know. No, that which. was against, that was against Woodies, I'm sure. I don't know which misclick it was, but it was a misclick. And he, the mate, the fact that he misclicked the kickoff as well was brilliant. Like he's <laughs> not played a game with him. <laughs> completely mad. <laughs> Uh, we should have that as a prediction. Will KFO get through a game of BB3 without misclicking? <laughs> you can basically guarantee it being no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Just 7 million channel points on no. Yeah. What a game. Incredible stuff. Strider was second. Funnily enough, I mean, uh, Strider losing this game will guarantee Diamed qualifying from Group B. But it's not over yet. Don't say it. No, no, it is over. It's, he's definitely lost. It's just it's 2-0 or 2-1. He has definitely lost. Even, even Elliot, if he was alive, would have to, would have to say that this one is over. It's the Blitz of Russell as well. Lovely. <clears throat> One, or two, block three, four, just five, block. six. Yeah, yeah, just block because he doesn't need. He's only got dodge. Gets the full oh. pow. Full <laughs> pow. <clears throat> right, catch it on the other Blitzer. Oh, in the crowd. Oh, it's gone the wrong way. Ooh. Oh, it would be funny if the ball just didn't come down. <laughs> <laughs> you got to replay the game. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't surprise me, to be honest. Oh my god, he can't pick up the ball. It's ridiculous. It is. He just literally can't pick up the ball. Well, there we go. You can probably two dice him here, can't he? He's got no rerolls. How far away is he? You could GFI and then go, what, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, GFI. It's just going to go for the 3 plus pickup. Just leap over him and... <laughs> Gets the pickup, what a dirty Dino. What a dirty Dino. There you go. 2 1, oh yeah. So the replays go back to the actual result, but live ones don't. <laughs> Brilliant. Um, but yeah, 2 1 win for Imperial Ability. Are you happy, Dimmy? I am very happy. I'm a very happy man. <laughs> very happy man. I was cheering you on the whole way. <laughs> I loved your uh, kickoff strategy. I'm going to steal that in the first half. Your kickoff was uh, really good. Putting it into the uh, injury bench. <laughs> Give them an instant touch back. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, just yeah, because he knew pick up. He wanted a fair game. He he knew that picking up the ball was impossible, so he gave him a touch back just to help him out. You know, that's the that's the kind of sportsmanship that Blood Bowl loves. <laughs> I do something silly, yep. Yeah. yeah, well, congrats. And uh, that's what the table looked like before this match. Um, so, yeah, that puts Core on three, puts him right up the table. And. Uh, oh, wow. And, yeah, and it, it, and it puts, a, puts a bit of a breaker on Strider. I mean, if Strider had won, he'd been right up, you know, right up the top. But now, who knows what's going to happen between one and three. Anything could happen in that game. We could have four points, five points, or four and three. So, yeah, lots to go with the final match of the oh, week. Tree, tree played monitor. Okay, right. Yeah, yeah Tree's playing monitor right now. So, we'll, so do, uh, we'll do the replay of that afterwards. But, um, so, basically, they, they, I think if you're a Nob fan, you want to draw there, I guess. Um, knobs, knobs could end up on five points. So you kind of, uh, but I think Tree's already 
No, Tree drew, right? Tree drew with Core. Yeah, so, so if they draw, they're on four and three. Yeah. And and then they, if they both lose their last game. But then, I don't know, one of them must be playing Strider, right? So... Yeah, that's the problem. That's the problem. It might. Or well, maybe be... yeah. So whoever's playing Strider lot, you want them to draw with Strider, and then <clears throat> they draw with each other, and then yeah. whoever, and then Monitor loses his last game, and then Kfo beats Olivier. Yeah, there's a chance. There's yeah, a chance. it'll be. It means it's Monitor versus Diomed then, doesn't it? It must. Yeah. It mean Mon I mean, we've we've got a link, you know, that we can just look and, and see what it is. That's right. That's right. I'll... Instead of you just rambling <laughs> and hoping that you're right. <laughs> it is Core versus Olivier, Strider versus Tree, and Diamed versus Monitor. It's the final week. Strider versus Tree. Ah, so Tree has to win that. And if she draws against Monitor and then win, she's on six points now. So then she's knocking out Kfo. So, yeah, I don't think Nobs can make it. <clears throat> it's only two sure. for a win, so no, I think I think he's in with a shot on three. We'll see. Oh, it's anyway. only two. It's only two for a win. Oh yeah, if it's yeah. only two for a win, then yeah, that's still doable. We'll see what happens, but anyway, uh, all to play for. Certainly, it'll be interesting to see what happens in the last match. Um, so yep, commiseration, Strider. Congratulations to Core, King of the Knobs, and uh, <laughs> thanks Whoa. Elliot and Dimmy. Being glorious having you in the booth. Yeah, you're you're, you're the knob father, Dim, or the knob champ. I mean, do you just want all of the knob titles? Yes. Okay, okay. I, don't, I haven't seen KFO's uh, BBT run with Nobility being 13 1 1, Jimmy. I mean, like, when when he actually achieves something in Blood Bowl, <laughs> uh, may, maybe we can give him king of the knobs, you know? It's fair enough, fair enough. And, uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.